In React, if you're working with server components and you have some sort of authentication implemented, this is probably what your components are going to look like. So here we have a page component. It is an asynchronous component, which means that it lives on the server and we can await things like here, we're awaiting the user using the get user function. And then if we don't have the user, we're going to redirect to the login. Otherwise, we're going to proceed as normal. And in here, now we have access to our user. Now, this is perfectly fine and will work exactly as you expect. The only problem with this is that now we have to repeat this code in every component that we want to have access to the user. So in the spirit of not repeating ourselves, let me show you a better way to handle this. Instead, what you can do is you can create a higher order component that does the exact same thing. So here we have the with auth component is using some TypeScript generics to actually get the type. And then it returns this asynchronous authenticated component, which performs the same logic here with our user, and then even returns the wrapped component and then passes it the user as props, which means that we can now go back to our main page component. And now we can here at the bottom export with auth and then page, and then we have access to the user directly in this component. And we don't have to write the same user logic in every component. Now we have one shared reusable component and we can use it in every page that we need to have access to the user.